classmates, class of 2012. It's hard to believe that today marks the end of our high school career. It has been quite a ride. Four years ago, we were scared little freshmen at West Campus. No need to sugarcoat it. We quickly became accustomed to the central way of life and in essence became a family. August 2011 came around and we began our senior year. And boy, what a year it's been. It helped that a popular theme this year was YOLO and we quickly adapted to that lifestyle. This was evident through our, <laughs> through our many activities including homecoming, winter formal, Sandy Hawkins, prom, as well as all of our crazy rallies. We accomplished so much and made history in so many ways class of 2012. We had the first ever more suits, the most track championships in one year with five, our first girls valley championship since 1984, the most valley victorians ever with 29, and our very first academic decathlon valley championship. Those are the obvious things. I learned so much more from all of you guys. I learned what it means to have true friends. I learned how to still look cool riding in some yellow school buses to Six Flags for grad night. I learned how to cope with the loss of something that's very dear to you and such a close friend. Rest in peace on your rights. And I learned that, I, I learned that YOLO doesn't mean to just live in the moment, but to live for the moment and for the many moments to come but to understand the potency of the decisions we make on a daily basis when they can change the trajectory of the lives and influence the lives of those around us. For instance, here's a bit of advice. It is essential to always check your bag before you leave the drive through But not to worry. For those of us going on to college, we'll be living off top ramen and any free pizza we can score on campus. But in all seriousness, we have countless amazing memories and maybe a couple that aren't so great, but just know that our best ones have yet to come. And at this time, I just really want to thank all the teachers and faculty who have helped all of us along the way. A special thanks to my mom and the rest of my family. And last but not least, all of you, my friends, who have shaped me in some way, shape, or form. And made me the person I am today. I hope I impacted all of you guys' lives in some way. And that I was a fun, effective, and positive senior class president role model to all of you. Remember, once a grizzly, always a grizzly. I love you guys.